Hey, it's a haul, y'all. <laughs> Not a very big one, but I, I still did a little bit of damage. So, um, there was something that I honestly, from, I ordered, this order is from Frantic Stamper, by the way. Um, there was something that I absolutely could not live without, and so it kind of morphed into a little bit more. But anyway, all right, so this stencil is from Visible Image, and it's called Skull Shadow. Technically, I'm still somewhat pleased with myself because I didn't order like I usually order. So, But anyway, so that's just a cool stencil there, I think. All right, um, next up I have some MFT stamps and dies. And this is called Drink Up the Sunshine. And it's got this cute little girl image here. And, and while I like this, I wish there could be like more of a, an adult image, I guess. But um, but I love all the sentiments. And the cute little sunglasses and the little coconut drink. And anyway, the little palms and whatever. And the little bird. And anyway, it says, uh, can we chill together soon? Have a sunshiny birthday. Drink up the sunshine. It's so cute. But the fabulous thing that it goes with, what makes it so awesome, and this is partly like the whole order, um, is this. So you cut like the swimming pool and that she's in out with this die, and then you 3D it with this. Um, I don't know if you guys can kind of see, but it's like you pop it in and then um, there's like a little seal around here you take off the tape. And these are just called swimming pool shaker pouches. And boom, you've got your shaker and it's done. And I love an easy, fast shaker. So that will go with that. As well as these will go with that. And this is called uh, Sunshine and Friendship. And it says, it's time for sunshine and friendship. You deserve some downtime. Let your troubles float away. Relax and soak up the sun. Um, hope your birthday is a splash. And then lots of little animal critter type things. Um, so anyway, like who could just pass that up? I love that. Um, but easy shakers, it's awesome. So then I was going through some stuff and I found Studio Light. And I'm um, still on Frantic Stamper, but I had not noticed these before. And there's one set of so pretty. It's like the ocean floor, but they were sold out. So hopefully they'll get that back in. But um, a really cool rope, some little seaweed, some coral. But I love this. Not all treasures are silver and gold. And it's got the little treasure chest here. And I just think that's so sweet and special. So couldn't pass up that. And then... Um, I'm sorry, this is... Not only Frantic Stamper, but there is one other company in here as well. I forgot. I will show you then. Um, anyway, so this is called Wooden Flourish Pack, and it says Tea Party. And I actually picked this up um, a long time ago. Maybe, I want to say it was just like at Michael's or something, but it could have been Frantic Stamper. I don't know. But anyway, um, I love these little teacups, and I've been finding tons and tons of tea stuff that I have. And I'm kind of putting everything together, like all my bee, like bzz, bee stuff, and then all my tea drinking stuff and coffee and whatever as I organize, and I've realized that I have quite a bit, and so I really want to um, do like maybe a whole series of bee and tea cards. Um, so maybe we'll do one day of bees, one day of tea, I don't know. But anyway, um, I have a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of ideas, so let me know if you like bees and tea, please. Um, I don't want to overwhelm you guys with too many B and T cards, but um, I, don't, I have quite a few ideas and quite a few dies and stamps and different things. So anyway, cute little doilies, little cups, little roses, um, cupcakes, little teapot, and then uh, this just says Forever Friends. So that'll be just cute little additions to that. And one way that I was kind of getting myself not to shop, because there was like a thousand things in my cart when I started, was I would look through my, um, you guys know I'm trying to cut down shopping. <laughs> um, so I would put whatever I wanted in my cart, and then, um, or my online cart, you know. Then I would come in my stamp room and try to find something that would work like it or close or something. And lo and behold, you know, I pretty much had something that would work for so much of it. So I was able to take all that out. 
Um, but that's what I'm going to have to do with myself, like talk myself through it or something. Um, so that, you know, you kind of, you end up using what you have and realizing what you have, first of all, and um, kind of making do. And, and honestly, like I didn't miss any of that stuff because I had something that would work just as well. And uh, so I was super excited about that. And I was like, ooh, ah, ooh, <laughs> so excited. But um, anyway, so, but it doesn't always work because, like I said, I have quite a collection of tea-themed things, it seems. And, but in looking at the tea-themed stuff online, I didn't have something like this. So I went ahead and got this. This is the Dye Zire uh, by Crafter's Companion. Um, it's the, uh, it's called Afternoon Tea, and it's one of the Edgeables dyes, and isn't that adorable? So cute. I don't really have anything like that, so, you know, have to get that. But, so I didn't say it always works, but I did take out, like, 95, I'd say, percent of my cart, what I actually wanted. Um, and I'm just as happy with this small purchase as I am the big one. So, okay, so now let's move on to, oh, wait, I got free stuff. Let me show you that um so this was my free thing um it's like a little wooden die cut type etched something i don't know i uh, say it's got free sample on there um so scrapping ec.pl i don't know what that is anyway a nice little um there it is scrapping ec die cut chip cord okay but i did get these too um these were the alice uh, somehow tea makes me think of alice in wonderland and I like the little fancy tea stuff, but then I also like to crazy it up with Alice. Um, and this says, Reality is a Prison. So that's really cool. It's just die cut. And I wish I could have gotten more of these, but just was trying to limit myself, guys. Um, I did get two of these because I know already of an idea I want to do with these. And see how intricate all the little cutting pieces are. But you got the little teapot and the key and the cards and the um, stopwatch thing, and I think that's teacup too, um, but anyway, it's so cool, I just love those, so anyway, all right, so moving on to the next company, um, this is a company that I absolutely adore, and I haven't ordered anything from them in quite a while, I do have a whole bunch of their stuff, um, it is called Character Construction, and does she have, no, well, anyway, um, these are just little freebies that she sent. This is like a sticker. Thank you. And anyway, it's kind of like a paper doll kind of deal. Um, but, you know, um, um, like I said, I was going through my tea things. And so, um, she put here. I pull a piece of this paper. And uh, you can kind of see that better once you get all the details. So, you, me, and a pot of tea. And then just this gorgeous teapot lady. I think she's so adorable. And you can put arms on her and a little purse and a little teapot. And I guess she's just going to come here, come to tea. And anyway, but I have tons of things to interchange her with. And um, some other teapot stuff you'll see. I'll definitely be doing some of these character construction cards. Um, and actually, I have some bee stuff, come to think of it, with, with their stuff too. Um... There's, there's this really cool, if you ever go to their website, um, it's characterconstruction.com, and there's um, Theater of Dreams, and have a lot of those stamps, um, but each little set is only, I think, $15.99, so it's a pretty good price point, and um, they just have some, you know, kind of off-the-wall things, which is always a plus to me, so anyway, I also got this set, and I've got a third set, oh, there it is, I'll show you in just a second. Um, so it's got this cool mermaid and her hair is all swirly and she has little shells there and like a little shell necklace and anyway, I just love her and you can interchange the arms with lots of the, um, uh, the doll stamps that I have that have like, um, I don't know, just weird dresses or, um, like there's a theater scene in one, just all kinds of random stuff. Um, this is the other one. I thought there was three. Anyway, um, put this back up here so you can see her very well. And the number is the like the number of the plate. Um, and you can 
tell when you look on the website but so this is I guess plate number 14 uh, no rain no flowers but this gorgeous teapot but I wanted her um, I wanted this plate mainly for this lady look at the butterfly wings do you see the eyes in there like right there and right there you guys see the eyes I don't know anyway and she looks like she's going to this could be a birthday card um, you could leave the dream right there you could take it out just random things but I just really like that and then of course you got the obligatory butterfly and flower thing that you could add to whatever and a little heart so hearts are always good um so anyway that is my haul and really excited about these and um also that I found because I like with reorganizing my room um I found all kinds of character construction stamps like my section of them or whatever um that I haven't seen in so long and I'm so excited to use them again so all right guys um I will talk to you later hope you're having a good stampy night and let me know what your favorite thing is from the haul all right bye guys